of Australia. Thunder. Hold on, before I, I go, let's say thank you to everyone who's watching the Puzzles and Dragons version of it. I'm going to stop the video right now for the archive. And thank you guys so much for coming. And you guys are awesome. Don't forget to like and subscribe to the archive channel. And of course, links and stuff are in the description for my other channel. Thanks, everybody. I'll catch you. Just stop it. Awesome. I the Tasmanian Tiger. Do you believe we are playing the eight? Oh, they even have the Tasmanian Tiger. Okay. All right. So yeah, it's time for time for tie test. Um, I have a lot of history with this game, so yeah, we're gonna have fun. Um, Tide Test Minion Tiger is a PlayStation Two console. And fun fact: this game is celebrating its history as I believe it turned twenty last year. No, last um. Last month, it turned 20. Um, and we're going to play for the channel. This is a game that actually people were voting for on um, YouTube. And I finally am now getting into it. Um, that's always a fun. This. Okay. And I want to try. It's really big. Uh, huh, that's it. Um, there we go. So let me try. Oh, it should be right. Um, let's hope there isn't too many issues. Because of playing it as. I've had a lot of issues with playing my 3D games, especially the HD one. So, awesome! Okay, is it playing well? I just want to make sure it's playing. Oh, because I stepped out the thing. That's fine. Okay. Welcome, ladies and gentlemen. I just have to make it. HD, uh, first. This game. A very, very cool from the place I think I got. I think around 2002 when it was released. And my mom bought it at a game shop. There's a. Um... <laughs> right, I type. There's no point in mucking oh, no, about. It was a very cheap game when it came out. And that was Murray. That's the character we're going to be talking about. As it sits now. It says empty. We are gonna 100% this. Oh no, we're gonna 100% this because I have 100% games four times previous. So we're going to. So every time you see this icon, this is your auto save. Um, this game is beautiful, and it's HD. Re oh my God, it's HD. HD version is. Oh my God, look how cool. 
I see. I can't wait till we get to the actual game. But uh, this is the beginning of the game. This is a. Um, I believe it starts off with Kai's parents. All right, I think this is actually Kai himself, and playing hide and go seek actually um, from his friends. The area that he's in, we actually will explore this area um, later on as a level in the game. Um, but yeah, Tiger, Minion Tiger, he's a young tiger, a Tasmanian tiger. Uh, I gotcha! I gotcha! And that, that's his friend's ability vibe. Okay, Ty, I'm in. Catch me if you can. Catch oh. me if you can! Oh, God, the rendering here. <laughs> it's probably because I'm streaming. Don't move, mate! I'll get help! Oh, yeah, we're only hearing that a lot, mate. In good eye? Oh, man, someone called River Ross. Someone call string. <laughs> and yes, ladies and gentlemen, one our main weapon of this game. Don't be afraid, Ty. I am Nandukili, the Bunyip Elder. Can I might? It's time you knew the truth. Alright. Years ago, a great battle was fought over the fate of five mystic talismans. Alright, here we go, plot. Whoa. It actually what's funny is the, um, the commercial for this game was even crazier. Uh, I believe it was Mario, Crash, and Sonic. They were all in the um, comet. Was it? They, oh, yeah. High Comet. Um, ten, zero. Oh, that wasn't tied. Here's Those are tied. Yeah. Um, and now I'll show the, uh, boomerang. Uh, yeah, sorry the render is kind of, what the f Um, it might be due to the, uh, system. Now to restore the natural order once and for all. Mm -hmm. But yeah, we are... Um, Kai family. Oh my and... God. Never, never, never. Yeah. He stole the talisman. And I do believe he's and he warped them into different planes. Um Bye bye. And the boomerang. And this is what changes the area that we will be in a minute. Those brave few who challenged Boss Cass were trapped in the dreaming. Mom? Dad? Word grows that Boss Cass is seeking out the talismans again. He must be stopped at all costs. And I believe it's he up to gets you to find the talismans the before talismans. he does. It's up to me to save my family. Oi, Ty! Are you okay? Mori? Oh, am I glad to see you. Oh, you're never gonna believe what just happened. I was playing in the forest when the ground suddenly... And that's when you showed up. Rude! Sounds like you've got a fair deacon adventure ahead, adventure ahead of you, mate. Not that I'm into that sort of thing. I'd much rather be at home watching the footy. But I tell you what, you do the adventuring and I'll help you out where I can. All right, and that is... Uh, and now we are in Rainbow Cliff. Welcome to Rainbow Welcome Cliff, mate. to our hub By world. By the way, whenever you see one of these signs, I won't be far away. I've heard that if you press the action I'm button, that, you yeah. can talk to me, whatever that means. Okay, yeah. <laughs> now let's get down to brass tacks. If you're going to be out adventuring, then you'll need another boomerang. And I know just the place to find one. <laughs> Head down to Bly Bly Station. I'll meet you there. And that is Bly Bly Station, our first area. So, welcome to Tide Attack. I guess. The graphics are very PS2, but this means. Fuck 
freaking freaking. Uh, oh my god, it looks so good. Um, I have played this game on the original PlayStation 2. I have played this game on a uh, Switch. It is on the Switch, Xbox, PlayStation 4 and 5, and on Steam. We are playing the Steam version of Tide of Casual. Tide main gimmick uh, is these boomerangs. There are tons of them. There's a boomerang wheel, I believe. Oh, because we don't have two boomer. Okay, because we don't have our other boomerang. But yeah, basically Ty jumps, he bites, uh, which is kind of one of his melee attacks. Um, he can bite, he can jump and dive. Um, he can swim, but you need the second boomerang, and we get that from another world. Actually, all the first world stuff, um, we learned from it. And then I'll look at the kangaroos. They're so cute. Everything in this in this game is either cute or or gorgeous, and it's this is this game is the PlayStation with one. A lot of games put the PlayStation Two put one. But welcome to Bill Bill Station. Station. So this is the first hub area. Um, so we have hub. This is our big hub world. Um, it's kind of like Spyro, where it has like you have one big area. But then you have different pieces to it. Um, Bill Bill Station is one of them. Um, we have a lot of areas we can explore, actually. Uh, we can't explore this because I believe we still need our second book. Um, and actually, we need to talk to our friend over here. So, this guy right hey, here. Julius. This is Julius. Now, if I just re so, Julius these is going to be the guy that helps us with I getting might. the I different the different oh, areas. Me. Oh, um, I didn't see although there. he is a koala, just he some doesn't talk like the well, others well, with well, their Australian accent. Um, G'day. But, yeah. So, you old coot, <laughs> what's this contraption do? <laughs> this contraption is the key to finding the talisman. Why is this so? It's quite simple, really. It uses an oscillatory microfeeder to scan for trace energy signals that match the unique power matrix of the talismans. Huh? Uh, so basically, what he just like did is it makes more. Out. It basically searches oh. out for the talisman. Oh. The time he select the game's MacGuffin. The, key yeah. to powering the, machine. the main MacGuffin of the game. Thunder Thunder Egg. Egg. Oh, they're as rare as hen's teeth, man. Uh huh. You guys always. Couldn't you just use batteries? But <laughs> if right. only it was that easy. You see, this machine doesn't just find where the talismans are; it actually teleports them here. Struck me lucky. And that, my friends, requires a great deal of energy. So, uh, how is Ty here gonna find all these thunder eggs? Hey, I was just wondering that myself. A reasonable question. I've created these portals to lead Ty to areas rich with them. Of course, they won't just be lying all over the place. Uh, just our luck. A lot of them will have already been found. The true. trick will be convincing the locals to part with their prized possessions. But I'm afraid I can't help you with that. If you're as resourceful as they say, Ty. I'm sure you'll think of something. Righto, Ty. There's no point in mucking about. You've got to find a second boomerang. I'll see you in two up. All right. So, that is our mission. To collect the... Talus. Oh, please tell me this did not just go out on me. Not dead, it's just gonna give it a minute for my computer to raise. Uh, hold on. I'm trying to figure out which button to start. Um, 
says uh, you got um my controller wanted to go out again. Oh, I hate them. on W I have to I help you. I know one of you. Ah, hmm. oh, I hate this too because I don't know which one is paused. So this is gonna take a minute. I need to get to my main second. Oh duh okay um I hate when it's yeah, it's not paired to my color anymore, and it will don't know why it does it there it goes, okay. With the controller. Oh my god. Bye. I don't want to move the device. Adam. Oh, my controller is doing fucking okay. Oh. Where is so let's just Okay, so it's not dead. There it goes. Okay. Okay. So yeah, now we can properly. So our games we got fin is to find the thunder eggs. Uh, there are a lot of thunder eggs actually. If you see in the game, it's a we got a lot of stuff to fill up. We gotta collect all five talismans. <clears throat> Excuse me. We gotta collect all five ta talismans. There are seventy. There, are, yeah. Uh, oh God. There's some. There's at least two. There's at least seventy-two missions within the game. Um. Then we have uh ninety cogs, golden cogs. I think every level has ten golden cogs in them. Uh, so ten. There's at least nine levels in uh three per world with a boss fight at the end of each world. And then it's the final world. We got those little things right there, those are the rainbow scales. Um those open a secret area later on, and actually they help open one of the two secret areas. Uh, our life counter is up there in the upper right hand at uh, the upper left hand corner. Uh where that five is. Uh yeah, that's a five, not nine. Um that is our counter. If we get hit four times and that paw goes transparent, 
If we get hit, that means we die. Uh, the Billbobs, or the Bill Billbies. I'm sorry, not Billbobs. Billbies. Um, they are. I think that's their name. The little mouse creature right there, the wombat looking character. Yeah, those are Ty's friends. That's actually one of the characters that we met earlier that helped get help for Ty when he was stuck in the hole. Um, yeah, if uh, there's 45 of them, there's nine worlds, there's five of them each world. Um, that little egg thing next to the right-hand side, uh, bottom right-hand side, that's the missions. There's 72 missions. And then the picture, the image with Ty's face on it. Those are pictures. Um, another collectible in this game is to collect pictures for your album, scrapbook, um, that you get in the extras menu for the gallery. Um, they are actually pretty telling. A lot of concept art, a lot of different changes to Ty. And fun fact, you can see some of those changes in the game. I believe there is a way you can change Ty's appearance to where Ty can look different. He's going to look like the concept art. There's a metal version of him. There's a whole lot of stuff that you And I do believe some of it leads into the second game. Uh, Ty has been in Tiger 2. Brush fire. Uh... I think it's brush fire yeah brush fire which is more deep i haven't played the game and i did listen to a bit of the soundtrack it's not as good or like the first one all right it's time to go get our second ring and like uh julius said um approach the portals that julius has opened there's at least three of them in this area and press the y button if you're playing it on the uh switch this billabong has got a lot it's the X button, and if you're playing it on uh, PlayStation, it's Triangle Button. But yeah, welcome to Two Up. Um, sadly enough, ouch. We don't have both of our boomerangs, but we can get them later. We are going to get our second boomerang in this level, like uh, Murray said. Um, I said. I said. I found you a second boomerang. Yep. That's great. Where is it? Uh, you gotta go all the way to the other side of the level. There. Yeah? Well, it's not there. Right. Well, where is it? It's on top of Frill Neck Peak. Oh, great. Oh, don't worry. You'll just have to jump, run, rang, and bite your way there while avoiding Boss Cass's henchmen. Look, mate, life wasn't meant to be easy. True. All right, but yeah. So these little things right here, these are the energy orbs that will fill up a big machine um, at the end of each level. Um, what are you still doing? Oh, yeah, he, he does say that every time you get to a place he's already talked to you. Um, but there's our first Thunder Egg. Um, I was, I was trying to do something that I guess we I can only do in the PlayStation version. If you get close enough, you can bite get into... Bonza! I got one! Yeah, 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 one down, <laughs> 71 to go. He's not joking with that 71 <laughs> one. <get> move on. <laughs> All right, and that is the Thunder Egg. So every time you find the Thunder Egg or you receive one, you will see the Kai symbol for the auto save, and it will do, and he will do that animation. And yeah, some of them are laying around. Some of them are in different areas. I reckon those dummies are a complete waste of space. <laughs> Only last week I used one, walked two blocks, was clobbered by a frill, and then woke up back on the dunny, which was the best place to be given the surprise I got. Julius reckons it's got something to do with the space-time conundrum. But if you ask me, I think it's a load of bull dust. So you're saying that if I have an accident, I'll end up back at one of these? Something like that. All right, checkpoints. Uh, dummies, which are outhouses. I can't even get you. Yeah, they're outhouses. Uh, if you die, you will come back here to when the outhouse is. Uh, just like Crash Bandicoot, there are boxes here. You can break these boxes. That formation right there, that little hollow box you see right there, 
We can't do anything about that yet. Time. You've got a fair set of choppers on you. I reckon you could put yep, them to the good use by pressing the uh, bike For the controller, it's B it. for, um, Never mind, Ty. Move on. for a switch is A, and I think it's A. Oh. I think it's circle for PlayStation. So yeah, PlayStation controller, uh, it's... No, no, it's not X, it's square. I was speaking to a bloke down the local watering hole, and he reckons you can use your rings to it's take care of enemies and smash things. You ripper! He said something there, wait a minute, he said something about yeah, pressing bro. the throw button to use them. Uh, I forgot it's opening really. I do have to unfortunately show them off. Uh, those are enemies, those are the frills, they are henchmen, uh, uh, boss cat, who is a ostrich. Um, so yeah, you can hit your enemies, um, these arrows, these are a sign of, um, what is it, prognoms, um, uh, as well. Oh, boss cat's got your friend. no, not more cages. Struth, what happened here? Boss Cass did this. He's caged all your bilby mates and Bilbies. hidden them across okay. the land. Oh, yeah? Well, big mistake. No one messes with my mates. Now, there's a thunder egg in each area mm. if you free them. No yep. worries. Unless you're Boss Cass. So, yeah. Uh, the bilbies. They are, uh, Ty's friends. There are five of them. A ma, a pa, um... A daughter, a son, and a daughter and two sons. Oh, you youngins, have it easy these days. If you want to get a better look at yourself. Oh, the camera. Yeah, use the right analog stick to see the camera. Uh, all games have it. Um, that cog, that cog. We can't get these because we don't have our second ring, and I don't know how to swim. Um. If it's true, but I heard about this bloke who found 300 opals, then took them to Julius's opal machine. Anyway, something yep. weird happened, and he ended up with a thunder egg. <laughs> right, eh? All right, yeah. These are um, these are opals. Uh, these are what filled that thunder that thunder egg. Ah, uh, hang up. Are these dangos? Might be dangos. When I was a lad, there was this kid, Toothy Malone, I think his name was there, who could bite his way through a dozen pies in less than a minute. These aren't pies, mate, but I reckon you could chomp the lot yeah, by pressing the bite button quickly. Try biting them quickly to reach that thunder egg. Oh so, yeah, fight top there. Uh, if we rapidly press bite button, we can bite up them. There's gonna be more in other levels, and they do change. Um, these are these. These are rude enemies. Um, when we get our, um, second rank, we can be able to- Oh yeah, homing bite. Something Ty can do, homing bite. But, uh, yeah. There's tons of these around here, so these opals. Um, opal, which is our funny because so I think opal plus the name of the gem. Which I think these are our gems. Um, there are multiple colors in these two. There's, as you can see here, these are the red opals. And uh, we'll find those in the first area. In the second area later on, we'll find the different color. I don't want to talk too much about the second area because I don't want to spoil things. Um, or black, I guess. Uh, there's moth. Um, I show the map. Yeah, if you press the star button, uh, you see everything that is within the level. Uh, find three of the billy bills of the bilbies. Uh, collect all three hundred opals. Uh, time attack. Glide the gap. Bring the frills. Jump the rock. Uh, super jump. And uh, lower the platform. And as you can see in this world, which is something that they didn't do in the uh, original game, they didn't tell you how many boxes there were for the gallery. Uh, yeah, we'll get to the gallery stuff later because there's 
a special item we can get in the game that will help us make it a lot easier. Um, right now, there aren't too many worlds we can go to, but you can see all the MacGuffins and all the stuff in here on the main map. Um, if you press start, or, or I believe if you, because I press select, if you press start, um, you will see this. If you, I think these correspond with the plus and minus on the switch, um, which are, are plus and minus there, but yeah, um, those little question marks right there, those are missions. Um, the opals are the areas in which we've already collected the thunder egg, um, in the game, and there will be some more. That's all the area. Explore. Okay. Yeah, a lot of stuff I gotta, I gotta tell you guys about when it comes to it. Like I said, um, I love this game, and this game was a treasure during my younger years. Like, I got this when I was a teenager, and was able to... And it was one of the few games I played while the teenager. Actually, I own this game. I actually own my physical, physical CD and have the original Ace for it as well. And the original, um, I grab this? Oh, I can. Our first cog. Uh, Julius will tell us a little later about how special it will be. Uh, right now we can't get that buddy because we need to get, um, ours yes. right. Yes. This just might do. I tell you, Julius. Oh, hello, Ty. You, you know this golden cog? just might be perfect for my latest invention. Hmm? The Cogulaceous Boomerangerous Extrapolator. Right, what's that? Why, it's a machine that creates experimental techno rangs. Uh -huh. I need golden cogs to build a new one. Fifteen, to be exact. And if you find enough, bring them to my lab in Rainbow Cliffs, and I'll build you a new boomerang. You're on, mate. All right, and with that said, um, yeah, the Cogulacious Boomerangus, whatever. Um, basically, the Julius, Julius' side mission, uh, which will give us power-ups to our range. Um, well, will give us new range. Techno range to be more precise. Uh, techno range are range that are created by Julius. Uh, we go to his shop in, uh, Rainbow Cliff. You know, that's that nice, pretty area we saw early in the game. Uh, if we go there, Julius will give us... <laughs> will be able to give us... Oh, we can't get that because we can't fly. I mean, fly. Um, Julius will give us, um, a new rank. We have to collect 15. Sadly enough, there's only 10 columns in each level. Uh, but there are enough levels to where we can get all of the golden, um, I think it's all of night. Uh... Julius told me to tell you this, but I have no idea what it means. Apparently, according to Julius, you can lock your camera on to enemies at any time by pressing oh yeah, my and heart. holding the lock on button. Uh, that would be helpful with this thing. Uh, we're supposed to super chomp, but, um, big enemies like that, you super chomp. Uh, as you can see there next to our opals, we have a number two next to them. If we hold the bite button, uh, it will super hard, and we will do a super bite. And that super bite will allow us to crush enemies. Uh, I guess I can show it off. I have to, oh, actually, no, hold on, wait. Boo shot. Okay, I can show it off just to show you exactly what it looks like. Oh, extra lives. There it goes. Um, oh, I can't get to it because I can't swim yet. Um, that's also a uh, high animation for can't swim. Um, but yeah, if you hold the bite button, you glow. And then you do a super charm. Um, it's really good for beating up enemies. But we don't want to waste a super chomp. Uh, well, we were supposed to use one of them on that enemy. If you get like at least 100 opal, it will give you the next. Um, and it will allow you to. Bang, bang. Uh, oh, here we can. Nice, secret breaking, baby. Five cogs. 
All right, get out of here. All right. Oh, that was actually. I, I forgot. Yeah, we can know Early game playing Tiger Tasmanian Tiger. Um, my brain just went perfect. Um, get that stuff like. All right. Um, this here picnic basket. Find it. You'll get a magnet, which will attract the opals to you. So it makes collecting them a lot easier. Uh, when you put like one up in the game, they're gonna have tie space. Uh, you'll be able to get certain items. You'll be able to either get eye or you'll be able to get oh oh glorious moment and. And now we have both. Well, wouldn't have believed it if I didn't see it with my own eyes. <laughs> you actually found the second boomerang. Right. Well, there's no time to sit around and feel all pleased with yourself. You're gonna have to put that new ring to use. You see, I had a thunder egg I was gonna give you. But a bunch in the of frills stole it. Stole it. You'll have to take them all on to get it back. All right, but yeah. Oh, we got a key for it. Two rings are better than one. That is for getting back your, that's for getting your second ring. I do believe there are achievements in this game. I don't know all of these keys, uh, but I'm sure if we do stuff, we'll be able to get it. All right, and bam, yeah, Thunder Egg. All right, and that's for beating up all the friends. Um, I do believe we get a, um, aura? No, I think there's an achievement for each piece. I think there is a, a for being all the levels in general. Some levels are gonna be easier than others. I'm looking at you, world to um, down by the river tie. And no worries. Oh, and what is the other one? Uh, the backstop. Ugh. Uh, what is this? Oh, um, all, all of the thingies, all the things. Uh, so yeah, collectibles are, are Um, this is Ty's Tail, and this is a winner. Let me tell you what you look. Um, there are enemies in the water, uh, crocodiles, uh, to be more precise. So do be careful. Um, now that we have our second ring, we can start the over here. Um, oh, if you... Uh, uh, let's go kill you. Let's go kill you, bro. I can't see me doing this because there's another power up there. It, oh, it's right up here. I was down at the local watering hole last night, and this bloke was bragging about how he could throw a boomerang better than anyone else. He reckons if you hold down... Oh, yeah, this has nothing to do with this. With this here. Ancient answer. Uh... This, or you can do this. Where he roars, um, he's stuck, and I believe it makes you invincible. Mostly. But I guess I'm not doing that. Okay, anyway, first person is you. You can use it to help take out the crocodiles in the corner. Um, so it'll make getting to the call a lot easier. Um, later on, we'll get a, a better item, trust me. And we'll get a rain from Julius that will allow us to. Uh, to do that job a lot easier. A lot of people probably have never heard of this game, so I'm sure a lot of people are getting all the things. There are things to collect. Probably just all the magazines. Like getting all the opal, getting all of the um getting all of the golden cards. Collecting all the pictures. Yeah, this game is full of fight. It's Spyro meets Crash. Like if Spyro took a trip to Australia and became a furry. Um, an anamorphic furry. Uh, I mean, 
Anyway, um, yeah, basically this is just what it is. And Ty is basically the hero of the day. Um, we do need to go back a little bit. Um, backtracking becomes a lot easier though. Level. Especially once you are. Uh, oh yeah, that was a piece of pie. Um, and right there, as I said, if we hit certain objects, we'll be able to help us down. The thing, the hitting these buttons will allow us to hit these crates. And turning these crates will allow us here and uh, get to this. Uh, 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 and get to That wasn't a half bad effort, Ty. I reckon with a little more practice, you'll get there. Cool! Right in and the egg. I see. Come on. Hey. Grandma! Grandma! That's who it is. That's who it is. So it's mother, father, his mother, father, son, daughter, and grandma. That's right, y'all, grandma. Grandma says she ain't even left out. And then if we, if we go this way, um, we'll go get some more stuff. This is why I said I love playing this game because this game has so many different attached to it. Um, we do have one more Billy Bob obtained. Uh, we collected, yep, yeah, 300. We found the last opal. And we're not even done yet. There's still more opal to get. Um, it's just that that one we were able. To... Oh, we gotta go the other way. Where's Julius? Wherever Julius is, is where I need to. I don't believe. But I am hitting the check. No. Yeah, no, we gotta go back. Uh, we gotta go to get to Julius. Julius has... Where Julius was, there was another Bilba. A Bilby. Yeah, why do you say Bilba? Not white. I mean, they can be. The white actors are probably white, but... That's just Australian. That's actually Ty's. I don't know if Ty's was. I wonder how much research he had to do to, you know, get the lingo right for being... Okay, so yeah. I think for getting the lingo correct for, uh, for, uh, you know, for an Australian accent. Or, for they, you know, or was pro promo, you know. Finding all the buildings. 5 out of 45. Don't worry, we'll be getting all the achievements. This game is probably the first game I actually fully do all the things. I believe I have every. Uh, one, two, three. Okay, so I'm missing two cogs, and I'm missing uh one of them. I gotta go backwards. I gotta go. Get... But I think the other one is a time attack. On um, the first time attack, we actually do. That's. A... Some levels I will have to leave prematurely because I don't have access to certain items to get them. And by and what I mean by that is there are certain uh, rings that if we have them, they will allow us to uh, do certain things. Like for instance, uh, there's a ring that freezes. Um, there's a ring that can slow down there's a rain that can cause massive explosion there's a rain that can uh, allow you to see things that are not uh, that you can't see well actually you know that rain is cool i mean that rain gives me see things that you're not able to see before but um yeah there's a lot of stuff in that you definitely want to need to collect it techno rain the tech well the techno rings in this game they are i believe a other issue oh and we do need to come. why is it so hard to get this like this should not be this hard that golden 
Okay, here we go. I believe that's all of them in the level? Yeah, so I found 10 golden cogs in this level. Now we need to, I believe, make our way forward. To go back. Well, that we now need to go to the end of the level. So we can go get the opal from the vendor egg machine. From the opal machine. Oh, and high slide. If you press the jump button and hold it while in midair, get a go high. And allow you to go from place to place. Kind of like Spyro's so. Um, and then, uh, he has to let grass, of course, that's what he's boring. Um, bite, ties, front, well, ties, yeah, ties, bite attack, ties, boomerang, you can throw, and they come, they use this I never owned a boomerang, I wouldn't know if boomerang really do come back to you. I've seen it before, um, I've also seen boomerang do some good weapon. Um, funny enough, I think some, uh, yeah, Final Fantasy has some characters that have a hope. Uh, from 13, I know 13 is kind of the black sheep of the series. Uh, it ain't, ain't no more. Uh, it has hope. The, one of the characters in this, one of the main characters from that series. Um, he has a free run. Um, I believe his ultimate weapon is an ultimate. And it does come back to him. Oh, my rocket huh? Uh, this one right here, a simple glide over. And bam. And he gives you this. Uh, opal machine. And bam. Getting all the things. That's for completing our first world. And if you look up. The music that this machine made. Oh. And for every world you go to, it, uh, you'll see that happen where the opal has been around. And if we look to our right, it tells you to see these funny looking to Murray. A bloke down at the local water and hole reckons that if you stand in the middle of them, something weird will happen. He's at work point. So yeah, you stand in the middle of a circle of green mushroom. Hear that sound? Work point. Welcome to the trap. Race to the finish as fast as you can, mate. The checkpoints will lead the way. But miss one and the race is over. <laughs> Alright, welcome to the race. And like he said, these are checkpoints. These red and blue uh tech note out range. These are what you need to do. So they're actually pretty chill little race to the finish type of thing. There are going to be races with other characters that you also need to do for as well. So it's just... Uh, actually, this looks like she's pretty... Uh, I think I've always been... Uh, even on the first uh, Yeah, it's not that. So race from point A to point B. Uh, completing all the time attacks. And you do have to do time attacks because they give you... Um, they do give you thunder eggs. I reckon you've earned this. Yep. Oh, you also, Mary, what the? Dude, add one of these. All things collected. Alright, so we're basically done. That should be everything. Yeah. We're basically done, uh, except for the pictures. But we'll do the pictures later. Um, and that's only because we don't have an item to help us. Uh, we did see a box for the pictures. We don't have a way to. Great, and it's time to return to Rainbow Cliff. By the way, cutscene. Uh, our enemies have found the tower. I found it. I found it. Let me see that. At last. Oh, um, boss enemy. It's boss time cat. To move out. We got four more talismans to find. You there, fetch my bags. <laughs> Soon on imagine. Unimaginable power will be mine, mine, mine. <laughs> and just like that, Boss Cast is, has found his first talent. Alright, now that we have com 
this uh up. The other two worlds in this area now are Ave, walk in the park, and to right we have shipwrecks. We need to do shipwrecks first because shipwrecks um will give us our our to ability to swim. Race. And we're also to get to great. What is wrong with this water? And inviting sandy okay, HD version. It's a beaut spot for a swim if you know how. I mean, we will learn how to swim uh, very soon, actually. And just like that, we have a better jump entry. Oh, also, I love this the logo for the company. One of the mini logos of people. Um, but first off, Die, mate. Good to see you again. Shit, hey, Rex. You saved right. anyone today? Funny you should say that. Elle went for a bit of a swim out near Danger Spike. Danger Spike? Where's that, Rex? It's a nice little spot, not too far from Shark Reef. Yeah, and? Well, anyway, she's an excellent swimmer, but she hasn't come home yet. I'm starting to get a bit worried. It's true. I'm on lifeguard duty, so could you have a look for me? Well, I would, mate, but I, I can't swim. Tell you what, I'll teach you. Hey, you Follow me. Be able to when swim. you're in water, press the bite button to dive, then tap the jump button to start swimming. Okay. Wish me luck. By the way. Those boomerangs of yours won't work underwater. But I got a prezzy for you that'll fix that. These are aqua rings. I found them in you an old ship in years the ago. Version. That's cut through crazy. water like a hot knife through butter. If you can dive under the water and grab them, well then they're all yours. Alright. So what does it say? No more dog paddling. That is for being able to. That for being taught how to swim. Oh, and there they go. Okay, so they, you can see them before. The aqua rings work like regular boomerangs, but you can only use them underwater. Oh, and one other thing, you're not a fish, mate. So keep an eye on your air supply. Yeah, yeah thanks, Rex. Oh, I love how use that the aqua ring to hit this switch. It'll open the shark door, so you can be on your way. Sweet. So yeah, we got our second rank. Well, they're officially they're not our second rank, but they're our rank for when we're underwater. The aqua rank. Um, that icon right there, the bubble, that is your underwater meter. Um, when he goes out, you go out. One, two, four. And when you're above land, um, kind of like Mario 64, where you're you're vacuuming. Um, here's another one of those boxes. We'll be talking about my certainly item for it. Uh, we actually won't be getting that item for a box. Um, oh my god. But, yeah, welcome to the Uh, our mission here is to find Ellie, uh, Rex's girlfriend. I think Rex is white. I think she's a girl. Um, I can't. Here. Anyway, um, Ellie and Rex are platypuses. Yeah, this is um, another instance of the using Australian wildlife. Or he about Australia. Um, uh, these crates, I mean, not crates, those uh, beasts here, you can bounce on them. They allow it, they're like, the kind of butt. Um, I don't know if they're in the original. No, no, it was I think also, a lot of this is flashbacks um, in terms of the stuff that I played. So yeah, you can um, swim by pressing. Work, Ty. You've learned how to swim and use those aqua rings. With a bit of practice, you'll be a champion swimmer just like me. Yeah, beauty. Hey. And with that, we are taking our mission. Uh, well, our main mission is to find Ellie. Oh, and that voice there, that is the voice of one of your friends. Uh, that's a seahorse. There we go. Um, and I don't think it's a male seahorse. 
but um uh, yeah that seahorse is your guys for the main mission side missions for our all of it. Uh some of them we can't do we don't have a certain item to do so but we'll try our best. Uh, um there's a build these friends here as well. Um I my mistake earlier for saying, oh my god, I'm it's just the fact that this game is just HD. So a lot of the stuff is don't so, like the water is fucking gorgeous. Outside water. To be able. Um picnic basket. I believe mean, it's called a uh yeah, a magnet. Uh some picnic baskets can hold the pie, the pie is my favorite food to eat, I don't know. Um, but you can dive under here, be careful of those fish, they will eat fish. Um, there's some of the enemy, uh, frills underwater with water. Um, so be careful of them, they have hard Um, and they will try to attack you underwater. Uh, if you, I believe you hit them with the boring, it knocks out little HP. Oh, by the way, those, those orbs around me, yeah, those orbs will indicate when I lose, um, a bubble on the thing. Actually, it's a Especially when her feet. Oh, oh. Oh, these sharks are gonna use too. Yeah, they all work for boss cast. Like the crash did. Very good time to hit. Um Oh no, it's not this area. Okay, it's area later on. I think. But yeah, welcome to the great here. Um this is one of two levels I believe that have of exploring the great big. Uh the other one is harder than this one. Say that now. Um, Rex marks the spot. That's the name. Uh, Rex marks the spot. Rex marks the spot. Um, kind of not my favorite level. Just because I have to do everything. And everything is. I mean, everything. Um, most of the level is a treasure hunt, actually. And then one of the side missions. I am a craftsman. Oh, I'm like to get the fighting the craft. One of the side. I mean, one of the side. <laughs> In that level, all these side missions are at least together. Probably two. Watch out for um, the sea mines. Uh, they will blow. They will try to come next week. They will. Um, I think I might have missed. It. Yeah, I did. Yeah, and they will go boom. Want everyone to understand that part? They will go boom. Uh, there goes the boom. It thankfully won't kill you. Um, I think you can set it off prematurely by just using the, um, maybe trying to, and by hitting them with the, oh, with the actual one. My job will, who golden call, golden golden call. I do like trying to find my opals and stuff. 
um, or find the magnet to help me find my opening. This kid is saying it's very hard to find. Oh. Anyways. So I'm going to warn you. My dad makes me. I didn't eat some of it. I'm a pleb. Oh. Look his ass. He's right in front of you. Um, this is an entrance to a second area. Uh, we can use two passes. But... Yeah, so, um, yeah, one, two, four. Uh, so the three that you see in front of me, those are, the, are for, um, well, four in this area, those are the ones for the actual mission. Um, no, those are the other side mission. The ones over there on the other side where that mountain is, that's actually the ones that we need to get. There is an oval machine, but it's on, but it's locked behind the gate uh, where Ellie is it's on the little highway. So, uh, Hermit Crabs. Uh, please bite them. Uh, actually, have them let their defenses down and then bite them. We will get a rain later that will allow you to actually take them out. With the oh, I love the boomerang. Spoilers, that's the name of the item. It's called the boomerang. Um, and it allows you. Ooh, guys. Oh, and these lizards. <laughs> But yes, sit on a geyser. Boosha. As you float it. Um, and then we're gonna do the circle around the opal. And get a good look at this area. So there are coconut trees over there. Uh, we may not be able to be do we can't won't be able to do that mission. I think that we need the next we need a techno range to help us. Some missions, yeah. You will need techno range. Uh, some missions you'll actually need a particular item a uh, new actually uh, your items in this game are right because i'm going to say that right now um and there are various classes of those rings so some are a lot more useful than others not gonna lie um but basically that's why we have access to what we're doing and huh Take advantage of that. Okay. This. So, jump on these platforms. And we get our next weapon. And our other color. Another. And one of these has a cog in it. Huh? Oh, it's not this one. This one leads to the area that's, um, pretty. Which we do need to go to because, uh, as you can see up there, that's where Bill, uh, Bill B is. Uh, sand. Um, be very careful in the sand. Uh, that is not regular sand, that is quick sand. Uh, and as you can see... Yeah, there's an extra life of... Oh, and I, I failed to mention, if you collect golden cogs, um, one of the things that can be in the place of them are pies. Either whole pies or pieces of it. Like half a pie, um, yeah, half a pie, uh, or a piece of a pie. Half a pie, piece of a pie, or the full pie. The full pie is the full restoration. The half pie is half your HP recovered, and the piece of the pie is just a quarter of your HP recovered. And they are all random, so yeah, don't try to do no shenanigans. Alright, so up here is our next mission. Um, the coconut. Coconut. Uh, what we're supposed to do here. Zoom in, hit the coconut, fly to the coconut, it, yeah, basically, oh, we can do this, I don't need to zoom, oh, 
Uh, by the way, that's another ring we get. It's called the Zoom Ring. What the Zoom Ring does, it, it actually makes this mission a lot easier. Instead of what I'm doing right now, which is like going the first person every time and zooming in on the coconuts and hitting them. Um, okay, so yeah, the last um, one over here to do this and just do it to where you can get all the coconuts. And bam! And there's a thunder egg. We are doing good on the first world. Oh uh, yeah, and the reason why those things uh, help them go together, um, my regular boomerang don't have any effect. Um, they just put them in high. There are some rings we get later on that will pierce through their defense. There are tons of rings we get later on. Uh, that do defense piercing stuff. Um, wow, here they're using the deal turn. Um, there's the, the Kaboomerang, one of my favorite boomerangs in this game. Um, that's that. That's no cool. And it happens. Okay. Okay, so that Um, one of these has a, a golden cog. And luckily, I'm so glad I didn't X that up to up the, up the HD. The issue is that uh, because it's HD, the water is so damn clear. Oh, okay. Not a what I thought it was. The other two connect. Then there's this big one in the middle. There we go. This is the one I was looking for. The one with the golden cog. But you do need all the golden cogs to 100% the game. Because they are the ones that give you your move. This was probably one of the few that I had the harder time finding. Because me as a child, I mean as a teenager, I didn't really you know, pay attention to anything. Uh, especially not the things that I need to pay attention to. Because that's uh, story of my life. Um, in case you fall. Um. But yeah, this was 2002. Oh, wow, the Donna fuck out. You guys remember the Donna? You remember the Donna? I don't know. another area in the game where I guess I thought I needed the um oh actually they make this a lot lighter or it's probably because I'm playing it on a computer but uh this was very hard to see in the um in the original game because it was extremely dark even that on my TV was dark which that is a possibility let's look Let's get him out of the the ancient of the Duncan ship. Thanks, guys. And I do believe, yeah, that's everything under lane.
Uh, there's one more, and I think actually we're near it. It's uh, right behind us. It's a thunder egg on a pedestal. Funny enough. Um, yeah, when we do clean up, we will come back to this area. Because we do need to find the, um, the, the, the picture. I don't think there's any in the Well, not in this area. Because when we go back to the main uh, part of the level, we will find more stuff. Oh, excuse me. This ain't my favorite music. I'm completely excellent. Um, and I don't think we'll be able to get all of the items in this one. Hold on, call. Uh, 15, nine. Um, because I need certain boomerangs to help get things. And also, funny enough, some boomerangs will change your trajectory when you fly. Like, some will make it easier, some of them won't make it. Uh, some of them can take out an enemy faster than some of them won't be able to. Uh, I believe the egg is here? No. Okay. The opals are here though, not the egg. And we are more than halfway there. Alright, this is where the egg is. Uh, vendor egg nest. I believe that the Egg is cool. Press select. Uh, yes, quicksand coconut. Uh, getting to the thunder egg on the other end that has that you need to knock out the coconut with. Shipwrecked. Uh, hitting, going into the wreck ship to get at a cog. Uh, and that's it. So we just put thunder egg on the next. Oh, and. Um, fine. Oh, I'm sorry. Oh, sun and dark. Okay. I think they're on the other. I think. No, 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 no. Ooh, look, we're good. But I believe that everything on this side. So now we can just make our way back. Good. Uh, we do need to do Aurora Kids. Um, Aurora is. The, um, the there we go. And Aurora's children have been kidnapped by Boss Cass. And we need to go save them. Please don't be a Mac. <sighs> um, oh yeah, you can see from F1 and 2. Hmm. Oh, let me see. 7, 7, 2. So what you're supposed to do, get under these things, and the parts will not come. It's gonna back away for a minute. 
and then you go into the next one. All the ones with the ovals in it, those are the ones that are mandatory. Here, so far away. Um, they won't instant kill you if you die. Um, and I don't believe. So the ones that are close to. So, oh, ironically enough, have the most sharks here. Um, oh, and these bubble trails, they are there to give you air so you can breathe like the land lover that you are. Um, that kill him? Oh, it's done though. I think that's all the open there. So we need above lane. Uh, get on the platform, Tom. Thank you. And I believe it is. Can do this. Thank you. Oh, no, so I'm not close enough. Bam. And follow this trail of Opal. It will be Island, in which you find Rex's girlfriend. Um, oh, and Frill. Uh, Frills are actually those animals that are based off of the fight. Um, it, oh, and you're in Jurassic Park. I know there's a movie. Yeah, they're the Frill Wizards. Um, the ones that that guy from uh from Seinfeld, um, he they sprayed acid on. This was be like the comedy relief guy of the, of the movie, and he got sprayed on by this real lizard. Real lizards are really cute lizards. Oh, by the way, helpful. Button build by from Seven Forty Five. Only. 35 more to go. Um, we do need to come this part of the island. Because I do believe there are boxes around here. And if we go behind us, that is where the boxes and are in as well as the golden color. That's what I want. Before we go up the island, we need to go right here. Um, because there is a you got a nice scroll near the barrier. Um, we do need to hit this right here. I do believe you're too. But I'm just making sure it's too, so I don't want to. You know, I think that's fine. But I'm um, hitting that switch um, allowed us to hit those switches. Get two. This out of this album. This item. So there's certain parts of it. I believe we're only missing. We'll find them. Out. I'm fucking him. Oh, one of them is on top of the here. And the other one's on top. Like the very top. From the tip top of the map.
Okay, what else is up here? Okay, who else is up here? Ellie, that's his girlfriend. Got to be mistaken with Ellie. To the tin element. That off the tin element. Would be awesome. Alright. Uh, I miss you. Hey, Dad. Uh, hi, Ellie. Yes, Rex was worried about me again. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's right. Isn't he a sweetheart? Well, I better get home so he stops fretting. Right, Ivan. By the way, I found this on the way. Want it? Thank you. We got another Sunday. That is for finding Ellie. And um, that is our portal home. Uh, that right there is our way back to the start. And up here, uh, if I'm not mistaken, yep, there's a golden clock up here. And that is eight. We still have a couple more missions, and I do believe some of them will host um, Sunday. Uh, there's actually a golden card right there, and I'm trying to do some pro shit on a fly to On top of it. Knuckles doesn't have Sonic Adventure 2 battle. I mean, Sonic Adventure 2, I would just say battle. I mean, he doesn't battle too, but... Um... I believe there should be some thunder eggs. I'm missing. Well, then it should be the last of the thunder eggs. Listen. Uh oh. I'm missing three. Fucking go figure. Probably somewhere like Swam. Or Swam. I'm sorry, not Swam. Swam. Why am I? Uh, yeah, they're probably. I didn't realize that they were. Why is that? Is with the. Uh, with these bad boys, I don't have to worry about. Okay, well, fuck you do. You can outspin these clowns, it's not hard. Okay, I said that I, I got bit earlier, by the way. Um... So, it seems to be a missing three. Okay, well, that's one. I, I don't want to blow up these mines, just to if one of them has but it's gotta be somewhere close or it's gotta be somewhere where I just oops and missed them this is the only way I can see myself missing it I'm gonna check the main path I think that's probably what it is something I missed on the main path it happens, especially with these water levels. You will always miss Even when you don't think you're supposed to miss Yeah, mess up. I think... Uh... 300 opal. Practice place and aurora. Like I said, I can still get the other stuff is so I don't know.
stuff like that. Exploring. Now I can't find them anywhere. Please, can you help me? So, Aurora's kid. Um, Thank you. If that voice didn't sound any remotely oh. feminine, that is because that is a male seahorse. Male seahorses carry the baby, female seahorses don't. Yeah, there's a one species in the universe that we know of, at, at least on Earth, uh, that they... That they miss. <laughs> I'm pregnant. Alright, the men get pregnant, and, uh, they carry the baby. So, we go all the way around here, and we gotta... Like Aurora. Yay! Yes. I'm bring more. And luckily, they're all in the first area, not. In Creature, how can I ever repay you? Hey, I know. You can have this sparkly rock I found in the sand. All right. All right, and that is. Uh, oh, we're still missing one more mission. Um, we gotta find that girl. That's it. I would I maybe there is something I just was hmm. use a box or something and I didn't Cause those those things you do ask him That was not supposed to happen. That was from the guy there, so I guess it's guy the guy's just animation. I'm so good. I'm not to get that back. Um, 
Oh no, there we go. I just missed it because I'm I'm a guy. Uh six hundred. Are we done? Yeah, we are. Okay. So I just gotta do Rex's race. Actually, I can go do Rex's race. Because Rex is race. Okay. By the way, this is what this is the great gear you're in. Alright, it's also reflective. Um I need to go fire Rex. He broke of his race. Uh, yeah, so racing rat. Uh, that will get us a egg. Give me an egg. Alright, egg. Let's see. Break, oh, uh, breaker living. I guess it's for finding a, um, uh, thunder egg. So, Ty, are you up for a race? See if you can keep up. Alright. Racing Rack. Uh, this won't be the first time you'll be racing Rack. Um, but yeah, Rex is slower on land, but faster in the water. For this, they gave me the shot. We'll see. Let me do three, huh? That's how it is. And now we just race back up to you. And this is how we do where we do back to this. Um, fun fact to wreck the butler. They're not very good on land. They do really good for this. And I got to be squeaky too, but they got them higher. Wow. That is pretty And we'll be down to the next level. Walk in the park. Love that. Oh, that is my favorite new strategy. Which is cool. It's weird because I've only played it like this. I would be blind. Two, three, and four. Yeah, there's two. Huh? You little ripper. You fair dinkum beat me. I've trained you well, mate. My uh, swimming cap. Okay, uh, yeah, this game was down. Thank you. Alright, and that is another one done. Um. Where's the mushroom? So we, we, I gotta go all the way back. Oh, what well, a mushroom just to get me from. Yeah. Those mushrooms are probably there just to get me from the top to the bottom. I hope. I actually never took the warp from the mushroom. So I actually don't think I would know. Generally, where they would end up. I have to take them. I have a feeling they will take me to, um, you know, to, to the start, but still. I love this music, I love the game, and I love how to get Like I said, this is a PlayStation 2 game that really got me enjoying art. Without beautiful looks. 
Uh, we are going to the opal. We can cash in our opal. Our other thunder egg. Our last thunder egg in this level. Because I forgot the box. Broke had more than opal. So the opal machine. Go right to it. Dun, 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 dun. And bam. Of course. We will always hear that noise when we uh, get back to the opal. Now I have to check my ass back up to that damn mountain. Uh, Cause I don't know if this works off of Crash or uh, if this works off of Spiral 2 logic. But it's okay to level cause you've already completed it. Um, and it'll count. But for safety measures, cause yeah guys, a fun fact. In Crash in Spiral 1, in order to battle the first boss, uh, Toasty, you had to properly ex enter and exit all the levels in the first world. I'm not even joking. So, Town Square, um, was that? Hollow, Dark Hollow, um, the, the other one, Stonehill, I forget the other level, but yeah, all the levels that are in Spiral 1, except for the break of the flight level, you have to properly enter and exit them in order for you to count them as being complete. Just the first, I think it's just the first world, because your first checkpoint is to take on the balloon. I think on the balloon, oh sorry. It's to, uh... Oh, so that the balloonist can take you to the peak home world. Got one more world to do before the boss. Uh, I think it, uh, no, it won't automatically. But we have to actually take on the boss. Oh. Oh. Luigi, why are you... Like, uh, Sonic Mania is a good one. <laughs> Sonic, um, Heroes is a good game. Sonic Underground is a good show. Um, Sonic, let's name all the good Sonic games. Sonic 1, Sonic 2, Sonic 3 and Knuckles. Um, Sonic um, 3D Blast on the Saturn. Sonic um, Sonic the Fighter. I say, I didn't think. Sonic Heroes is a good. Sonic in the state? Sorry, guys. Oh, it's clean. Oh, it's clean. Oh, it's clean. I need it. Everybody's not real. Okay. Also, be careful. I'm not even
Right. I don't know what I Oh, they're right in front. Once I do this, I for dinner and then after I had said it for dinner. Um, actually, in an hour, I like to do. I do, I do suffer from acid wheat. And I can get hardware real easy because I'm a dumbass. Oh, hit it. That's that one. And if we're next couple days, it's so stuff. Amanda did the elegant fit or feather duster. The landing on this design was nothing, was not, was a lot clean. Pardon the potato quality. And thank you. Ripping the design. Oh, uh, yeah, she's had. But, oh, this looks so gorgeous. It's Rose Whip with the Harpy Wings. And Harpy's Pet Dragons, um, Preston Imp. Oh, that looks gorgeous. Oh, it looks so gorgeous. I'm gonna share this in one. Like Oh, someone's leaking Pokemon again. Oh no. I don't know what it is. Anyway, um, oh, that was so cool. Several packs, um, of those sleeves. And, oh. Ooh, and she might.
I'm ready. I'm ready. Uh, oh, um, Tier Elementals won the, um, YCS battle. Because, like, top 16 was one Tier Elemental, one Spark, and the rest of them were. Were, uh, yeah, Tier Elemental, easy Tier Elemental. Yeah, no one is a bug. Shut up. I'm fucking adorable. Oh, Crash Bash. Happy birthday to Crash Bash. It's been 22 years since Crash Bash was released. Oh, wow. That's evil. Oh, oh yeah. Wow. That is a span of everything. So, Crash Bash was released. Two years after Crash, um, 3 was released. Crash 3 was released. Yes, yeah, so, wow, 2000. No, 1999. Release the Crash back. Cause, no, 2000. Because when did Spyro, cause Spyro 2 came out? I mean, 3 came at the end of 2. Okay, yeah, that means. Okay. Sorry, because I was trying to figure this out. Um, for those who don't know, I'm a huge fan of Crash Bandicoot series. The sad thing is Crash Bash has not been released, so it's harder to play it. Unless I was playing on maybe Parsec. And I was playing it for an emulator. Um, Crash Bash was basically the one and done for like a really good Crash Bandicoot S um, party game. Um, we don't know about Crash Big Bang Boom. That's, that game doesn't exist. Anyway, um, so yeah, Crash Bash was really, um, is part of the Crash Bandicoot, the last of the PlayStation 1 Crash. Crash Bandicoot 1, 2, Free CTR and Crash Bash. Funny enough, it Crash Bash was not done by Insomniac. They were done by um, Euro Entertainment Production and Universal. This was after the situation with Crash Bandicoot. Um, basically, Crash Team Racing was the last Naughty Dog game to be produced. By um, by Insomniac, not Insomniac, by Naughty Dog. Naughty Dog worked on Crash and the Coop. One, two, three, and CTR. Um, they at that point with the issues that were going on, they ended up um losing Crash due to copyright issues. Not copyright issues, but just how toxic. That company Universal was even to the yeah at the point to where they were just like aren't even try to deal with this. They did. They um they at that point just did. Um so um so yeah at that point um everything had you know. No, here and there situation. Um, with what was going on with Crash Bash. Yeah, that basically was like how um, it is an unfortunate situation that happened when it comes. This is it is a. 
luckily they fixed a lot of like luckily Sony was a fix their relationship this up uh, Crash Team Racing. No, not Crash. With Don Dog. Because um, that's how we ended up getting um, for this. Yeah, when that situation happened, that's when uh, Don Dog was at the point, okay, we're just going to make another series. Yeah, they made several new series. Um, they did Crash Bandicoot. They moved over from Crash, and then they did yeah, this Crash Bandicoot. They moved over Crash. They did uh, no, they did um, Jack and Daxter, which that had a brother series with Insomniac Scratch and Clank. And then from there, um, yeah, from there, uh, Crash and. So, I'm sorry, because I'm off, um, yeah, so they went from Crash Bandicoot into, um, Insomniac, Insomniac, not Insomniac, this, this is Naughty Dog, so, um, Naughty Dog did Crash Bandicoot, then they did Jack and Daxter, Uncharted, and now The Last of Us. Which, to be fair, a couple of those games aren't bad. Just... Hey, to be very fair, people want their uncarded, and Naughty Dog is not giving carded. I mean, if they give us Last of Us carded, then I, but. After the bullshit they've done with that series, I hope that's that's out. Anyway, um, yeah. So yeah, one more thing to do. That is first. Um, we gotta do this last level. Uh, we got walk on walk in the park. This is legitimately one of my favorite. One of my favorite levels. Crash. I mean, I'm this is like this is my favorite song. Um, for Titan. Even though I haven't taken game. Boo! I have. Um, I still need to go play. That be good. Um, yeah, dude. I don't know why I have to go. Um, by playing them, I mean I'm talking about um, Crash Bandic. What I should be talking about? Oh, no, I played Crash. I'm talking about a Jack. Well, Jack. But no, I'm sorry, I'm blanking because I am blanking. I, I humbly apologize for my blanking. But I normally don't blank like this. I, I do. For my blank. Um, let's go ahead and go do Walk in the Park. Go do Walk in the Park. I think most people do shit right first because there are areas in which we. Do swimming, but uh, walk in park. Oh, smell that fresh yeah. rainforest there. See the cute wallabies. Wallabies. Surf the slippery water slide. Watch out for those witches. Uh, which you can see better in this game. I mean, this version, because I cannot see them in the, the pop in. Oh, the pop in. Yeah, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome to um, my favorite level. Oh, there's a golden cog right there. Um, this is a walk in. 
Okay, this music pack is different. Gonna be more and relaxing. This is this is top tier shit. This is like if I had like a top tier list of my favorite packs just for a calm, refreshing beat. This one right here. This is my shit. So uh, Shezza got herself in some trouble. This time, her and we gotta go save her. The the road. Yeah. But if that isn't bad enough, Blue I tongue lizards are near. Tongue lizards nearby. Oh, oh yeah. You reckon you can give her a hand? Shoot bet. I'm on my way. So yeah, um Shezza, who not to be confused with the singer. I think she spells hers A uh, S C A Shaza. Yeah. But that is still cute as fuck though. I mean, that is a cute ass name. Shaza. Oh, and I found out Shaza. She's from Oakland. Or she's from, no, she's from Vallejo. Um, I've never I think I've heard someone said I've heard her music. Um I was just actually No, you know what I'm thinking of? I'm her. I'm sorry, I'm a music loser. No, I am thinking of her. her is from Vallejo. Her, uh, the Grammy Award winning R&B artist, he is from Vallejo. I've never heard of her. And when I did hear of her, uh, my auntie was like, no, you heard of her. I was like, I've heard of her. Like, I play her in the park. I was like, oh. But, oh, okay. Well, I, I didn't know who she was. Oh, so, you know, I had actually questions. By the way, new enemy. Um, these guys. Um, Heracross Beetle. Um, hit him. Uh, hit him with your rain. And then bite him. Oh. Oh, there you go. Sorry, just, I'm plumb. And there's the other end of the level. But yeah, welcome to, um, so yeah, here's a funny thing. Okay. Here's some free advice. If certain enemies deflect your rings with their thick skins, oh, hopeless against those pearly whites of yours. <laughs> Which so isn't true, because I just had to rain. The bad guy. Which isn't true, because I just rang him. I had to rain him. Thanks, Murray. I mean... Yeah. All right. Anyway, uh, yeah. This, uh, fun fact: the PlayStation 2 version of this of this game does not have rain. They couldn't generate the rain for some weird reason, or I think it was there. You just couldn't see it. The PS2 graphics would be like. And also, what is up with this enemy design? No, let's talk about this. You're supposed to have your your beetle. But your eyes are on. Your eyes are like Pokemon Sawaki Desu anime eyes. What the shit is that? Anyway, I love this game. Um, welcome to Tide of Tasmanian and Tiger live stream session one. I'm your host. Alright. I think that we're supposed to talk. Uh, I mean, uh, yeah, I know I got hit. It's okay. Uh, still be. And then, what is that? Oh, yeah, we can. Yeah, the little cave over. I don't know where this one leads. Oh no, this one leads to over here. And then then Oh, yeah, cause this one has a Pearl. And this one has a little oh. oh and if you look to the side, um that's the waterfall that we're supposed to crack. Um, and I think you can see the golden claw if you go back to find out where the area is. Um, 
Yeah, we're in a muddy cave. Um, it's muddy. No, there's, yeah, no, there's nothing else wrong with it. Anyway, so, mushrooms and flora and fauna. Mushrooms are fun guy, they're actually not the, um, yeah, that's the crazy thing about mushrooms. Just because mushrooms are, um, poisonous. Um, don't eat mushrooms in the wild. No, I'm dead ass serious. Don't eat mushrooms from me. Uh, there's, there's a little... Uh, do we fall over here? Yeah, we... Uh, okay. And I think that is sister. Um, Rafflesia. Um, this will shoot you upward. I'm not even joking. Yeah, Rafflesia. In this game, they are your... In certain levels, they are your mean, uh, super jump. To higher areas. Um, here, Rafflesia, um, is not gonna be our super jump. Uh, take Rafflesia, but we're not gonna... Well, we'll super jump thanks to Rafflesia. Uh, there's one more world that we replace your shenanigans, but not right now. Oh uh, yeah, it, um, that's three of them on this. That's two of them on this path, and that's son. Yeah, that's son, because we're missing mom and grandma. Grandma. We got like this, but this takes us to the start of the world. Follow me. The flora. The fauna. The elegance. Oh, the worms. But big ass beetles. Back then in Australia, you are not friendly for me to come. I have to get you distance or play. Oh man, I should have paid a dollar to add stream. That's the creepiest shit he's ever seen in Australia in terms of the bugs. I'm not coming. Nah. Like my Australian friends and Australian viewers, if I have any. I'm not coming to Australia. That shit's scary. That shit's like mad scary, yo. Listen, hey, hi, Tom, Julius. You tackle this water slide. Yeah, you're in a, uh -huh. I move left and right. Okay. Um, you can jump. I highly would recommend it. And do be careful. There is the point. Um, it will hit you. It has no flex given, it will hit you. Um, so, yeah, do be careful. Um, so yeah, welcome to literally my favorite area in the game. Motherfucking. Uh, the motherfucking walk. Because this literally is a walk in the park. Um,. I live in Northern California. Well, I live in, I guess you'd say, middle. I got it. No, it's still Northern California. Like, I, I don't know where the cutoff point for help. Oh, those are the leeches. Um, take a bite out of the leeches. Yeah, there are leeches in the water. And those are the purple. I didn't know you got any sheep. Um, so we're not gonna visit him yet. Um, although, no, no, we do need to visit him. I'm sorry. No, we need to talk to him. Oh, give him a sec. Oh, oh. G'day, Cobber. Oh, G'day, Ranger Ken. Ranger Ken. Need a favor, mate. Oh, someone's drawing furry. Came bats in there. Oh, I know. There's some furry. It's nearly the wet season, and we need to move them out before the caves flood. No worries. Alright, so we're gonna be a butte and go help Ranger Ken. Um take uh oh yeah, there's big pie. That's all your eight. But uh um, we're gonna help Ranger Ken get those sweet, cute, not ugly rouge to bat like animals um out of the cave. 
And once we do that, uh, we'll get a vendor egg for Yeah, just like we heard before. Some of the vendor eggs have already been found. We just have to convince the local spot for them. Um, I think with the session of your really, really be friends who I think once you collect all of them, uh, you'll be able to get the thunder egg from the last family member that you world. Uh. Okay, so the achievement will be 100%. Okay, okay. That is all of them. Replasia to get back up there. Fun fact about the Replasia plant. Let's talk about the Replasia plant. And the Replasia is a, a parasitic plant. Um, it feasts on its host any nutrients from it. Um, and will move from host to host if it does not get what it wants. Um, fun fact. Um, Pokemon takes reference to this creature as, um, the Pokemon known as Bloom and the Pokemon known as Vile Plume are Rafflesia. No, I'm not even joking. They are Rafflesia. Um, and they're based off the Rafflesia plant. Um, And um this is also this one. Uh, I know it's um I know it's Bloom who's the bud and Vile Bloom who is the full flower. On your light. Here's something for your troubles. Oh, you you. Okay, we'll see you later, Hansen. Alright. What would he do? Oh, he probably Welcome. With hot shirt, with hot pants. Okay. I can take furries in. Anyway, um. Alright, so we've done that. As you can tell, yeah, there is another, um. Thingy thingy in there. Uh. Another box, I believe. In this level. Thing. I think I've seen most of them. But this is another interesting. Inchi. Now let's go ahead and try waterfall. And be careful with this one. I think this one has split path. So we might have to come back up. Let's go. To obtain all the. I don't believe. Use your ring to hit any of the debris. That'd be nice. And I thought I was gonna end it. And I forgot I was going to But yeah, Rafflesia. Um, speaking of Rafflesia, let's talk about Yu-Gi-Oh. Yu-Gi-Oh has a um, Scott Trish Rafflesia. He is a link. He's a rank for exceed monster with about 500 attack and 2500 defense. Um, Rafflesia's effect is that while she has a two materials, oh, right, the Earth actually plant type is. 500 attack to 500 defense. Um, and she requires two level 4 monsters for her eight seven. She's very generic as she is. Now, her ability. Um, Reflesia. Uh, uh, Patrick Reflesia. Um, her ability is that while she has track, while she has the material, um, she is unaffected by trap pull. Like normal trap card. Hagi tractors are unaffected by trap card. Um, I think primarily normal trap card. 
Don't worry, we will come back for that later, because that's just the key. Um, yeah, so trap trip, trap pause. Um, or what do you... Of course, we'll be dealing with trap trip. They, their whole archetype will be trap trip, so you will be folly as infected plants, who are based off carnivorous plants. And some of them kill little, they kill insects and plants. Not humans, because I don't think any of them are toxic stuff that I know of. But, yeah. Um, actually, if you, uh, yes, he talks about the trap track. And one of his, ironically, that, uh, he talked about the entire trap track archetype. Um, up until I think before the release of some of the cards in the some of the modern versions, because that's talk about Sarah, the first Trap Trick Link monster. And I think some of the Trap Tricks that came out came out. So none of the newer Trap Tricks than the ones that are part of the um, structure deck. Here the Trap Trick, which is the name of the TTG name for structure. Um, and the other key is called Forest of the Trap Trick. Um, and it does still have the same cover um, for Captain Arthur. Okay, so this lie right here. We see it, right? Hmm? Fucking bird. Uh, fucking ostrich. No, no. So we gotta chase this. Um, he took, took it. What you're supposed to do is you're supposed to trick him into laying his guard down when he least affects it and then I mean go be nice. Alright. Um you let him let his guard down and then you uh Take get the thunder egg, and I am doing this completely. Wrong. Yeah, also, welcome. Tree. Um, there's a couple of one tree I'm gonna encounter later on will have um, a thunder egg, and not in this level, but in the other forest level, will encounter later on. There are several forest levels, man. I... This is just one of them. One of many. Uh, I think every level or... Oh no, this is this one. Is on the lab? Nice. Hey! Awesome. I think it'd also be better if you just take out all the in stuff on or you can get thunder. I forgot how I initially did it. Um I think it involved monkey rain. And we just getting the stupid bird looking. I don't have the monkey. Okay. Now the multi rings are a um, praying that we we won't get
Tricky case. Okay. Climb the log. I gotta be kind. I know we're fine. I completely missed it. I wasn't. Oh, uh, that's good. Oh. That was a waste of time. Anyway. Um, the next part here is just getting up to Tessa by dodging shoulders. Oh, and they hurt a lot. I forgot how you guys just jump and light up. That's what I'm thinking. And tricky shit like that is why I hate I have trust issues. Golden. I think we have one more gold. I think I know where it is too. I think I missed. Oh yeah, and then this shit happened. They started jumping up and they start bouncing like a fucking rubber ball. Like I don't need this type of shit in my life. There's Shaza. We'll help her later. Right now, it's time to collect like our juice. That is just these two. Oh, I don't know what that is. Oh, well, luckily there was a, uh, a dun near Shaza. But uh, yeah, the, oh, I believe the opal is on this side. Okay. <laughs> All right, getting back to okay, getting back to that ass because these girls can't catch these hands. Girls catch hands. Oh yeah, we're done. Yeah, because you're the last of the opal. Right. Last of the open. Right. Three, 90. I mean, nine, 900. I know that said 900. 350. Alright. Understand that English. Understand that lingo. Alright. And then there's the last of the cog. Got 10 cogs. And this left. Oh, we have 30 cogs. That means we can get. Oh, are there leashes here? I don't hear any. No? I always check behind the waterfall. You never know. You can always see something. I like that. No, no, I like that from Zelda. What's that from? Like? What's that from Zelda? Zelda always told me. Zelda taught me. Check behind the waterfall. I would have said Earthbound, but I didn't play Earthbound Tower. Um, Shaza needs some help. Uh, basically, use your boomerang to throw... Hit the boulders with your rang so they knock the blue tongues out of the way. Yeah, so Shaza is trying to fix her... Her, um... Yeah, Shaza is trying to fix her shaft. And the blue fields won't leave her alone. So, um, hi. Get your shit together, hero. Back there, possum. No worries. By the way, I found this at the creek. 
You want it? Shoe ripper! Well, I better get a move on. See you soon, Possum. Yeah, that's shut up. Um, that's run. Um, okay, so that's the race. And I believe that's the one in the log. So let's go get the one from the bar. Get the race there. Uh, the race is basically just getting to the end of the waterfall in the shortest amount of time. I believe. Yeah, if we take this waterfall, it's waterfall. Uh, oh, there's the one. I think we have all of them. I think we have most. Yeah, we just need two. And then we gotta come back for the pick. The pictures are what I'm saving for last because I need the rank that has to be. Yeah. There is the hog in the hog, my friend. Wow, okay, I'm, I'm great at platformers, I, I guess. percent completed it because I never found the last um, apparently the last box that I need I did had any box and I thought I collected all the boxes and no no I didn't uh, they make them a lot easier in this game to find thank Christ so what do I need to do I need to get to the other uh, list. Since I started eating Chipotle, I've learned that I, I'm essentially a fatter bitch than I ever thought I was. I don't hate being a fat bitch, but I'm a fat bitch. Fat bitch that look, you eat some Chipotle, I'm saying. I like it. Oh, so good shit. So, beauties out there. Alright, um, uh, this one take me? Oh, that probably takes me back to the one I did. So, I need to get to the thing of luck. Yeah, I don't get this either, because this should have been something they should have fixed. At least in the HD port, but then you go all the way back. Oh, because that's the oh, good. there we go. Let's you and me race, bro. Oh, yeah, this guy. Um, I don't know his official name, but you raised him a couple of times. He has a name, I just don't remember off the top of my head. But yeah, you raised him um, on all the levels with water five. He's your cuckoo to quit. But then again, you're not supposed to say that. Right. Because you wrecked. Race wrecked. Um, there's like four different races you 
at Tiger and the Tiger. Um, two against this guy, two against Rat. And cheating bitch. Cheating bitch. I told you you couldn't beat me. No one can beat the Andy Man. Andy. Go Andy. Go Andy. Uh uh. So you wanna try again, huh? Yeah, you cheat. I always take a short time. It's available, take it. And he did too, because he knocked me into that. What you think? Papa Nata. I know what I think. Learn that word. Big time. You learn. You're four. Alright. Oh, I did it! Fucking thank you. That all of them. Yeah, that's all. Trying. Got to. I in. Oh, I think this fell off. Oh. Oh, I learned some new shit. Oh, hey, look at me want to do. That reflection will only appear at the beginning of the level once you've done that. As you get to it, that makes sense. They want you to actually play the get level out. I give you basic shots of the help shots on it. All right, so let's go back. Yeah, let's call. Yeah, let's go back to the other level. Let's go ahead and take on the boss. Oh, we're not to take on the boss. No. Oh, good. I was say they're not gonna lock the scene. I mean, they will once we give him talk to him. But, all right, let's go ahead and go talk to. Him. Let's go ahead and talk to Julius over here. I was gonna wait till after we've beaten the boss. Um, no, we can do that. Yeah, let's let's go ahead and check on the boss. We can wait for this because the element because those yeah the techno rings. No, no, we can come back for the techno. No, we're gonna take the boss on. Huh. Priority. Go get the talisman. First, let's talk to Jolly Julius. Good guy. You've collected enough thunder eggs to power the machine. Let's give it a go, shall we? Awesome. Out outstanding! Simply outstanding! The energy levels are off the scale, and, and, and... Yes, yes, I've got a lock on one of the talismans! Stand back, Ty! It's coming through! Yeah. Julius found one of the talismans, and... Uh, it landed in a portal? All right, the bull's pin. So, uh, our first boss is a rampaging bull. The gimmick of the level is to make his sorry ass. So this bull. Yeah. Uh -huh. So yeah, this bull. Um, I want you to hit him. It's supposed to make him bump his head into, uh, into the... So yeah, he's not stupid. He knows what's going on. He knows he's trying to hit him. Okay. 
Ayo. Subject of lost cat. It's funny for someone who hates mammals, he surely is using them as instruments. That lizards. Hey, and we got our first talisman. Um, uh, that's using your head. Well done, for defeating Ty. Bull You've retrieved the first of the ancient talismans. When Boss Cast discovers that we are out to thwart his plans, he will do all in his power to stop you. Be careful, my friend. She'll be right, old timer. Shock me, lucky you actually found the talisman. I just might have bet on the wrong horse. Anyway, mate, Julius has got a present for you at his lab. Oh, I love him. And how things look in our amusement. So, I've Julius. made <laughs> a most exciting discovery. The talisman machine is brimming with excess energy from the Fire Thunder eggs. By diverting Fire that energy thunder. to my special hyper techno boomerang maker, I can make special elemental Elemental thing. Watch. Simply smashing, I present to you the flamerang. Ah. You beauty! They sure are, Tom. Yes, yes, this ring can start fires and melt ice. Nice. It even has a more powerful effect on some enemies. To select it, use the previous rang and next rang buttons to cycle through your collection. It will aid you well in your quest. Now, go try it out. Uh, thank you, Julius. Uh, with that said, let's do the Detecno oh rang machine. Oh my! You've found enough golden cogs, haven't you? These will be perfect for my latest invention. I call it the Cogulacious Boomerangerous Extrapolator. Ty, it's a machine I designed to create cutting edge techno rangs. Oh my, this is very nice. It's a Zoomerang. Oh the Zoomerang has a built in telescopic aimer. Press the Ties oh, View button to activate it. Use the movement stick to aim and the camera stick to zoom in and out on enemies for greater throwing accuracy. No worries. To select it, use the previous rang and next rang buttons to cycle through your collection. That's basically your D-pad. Haven't I told you already? I'm down one? I guess so. I got a color. I'm missing one in shipwreck. Oh, I guess so. Skins. Oh yeah. Um, these are all oh, these are magnets. Cool. There's a a classic tie, prototype tie, um, in which he's wearing red instead of green and i mean green instead of red he has flowers both daisies and daffodils um and also he's wearing shoes in the in the, in the product product not wearing any shoes i guess they're trying to make him look at him for more i gave him shoes. Oh, i forgot he has a green ass guy uh so yeah and then he has black and white I look like a little convert. 
a ragged tie where he's a whole different color. Um, he looks black. He has he doesn't have left eye. Uh, I guess that's, that'd be his right eye. Okay, I was like, he's he has his right eye. Um, he has a brown nose. Uh, he has little straps on his gloves. Of course, his shorts are wine green. Uh, with ca oh, they're camo. Okay, a little polka dots, white like, polka dots. Um, on it, he has uh white stripes instead of the brown. Um, where his stripes are, cause tiger. Uh, flounder. Um, more of a flounder. Okay, so he's beach boy, blonde hair, um, red eyes instead of. Red eyes, blue eyes, uh, blue outfit, instead of classic red. He has a uh, sky blue and navy blue shirts and ascot. Has a belt on. Oh, he has three colors on his tail instead of classic two. I guess the one for the tip. Uh, sky color or sly color. So he has uh, skulls on him, uh, belt, shoes, socks, skulls. It's a, a brown with a tan, blue eyes, gray handkerchief, a little tooth necklace, very cool, a swimsuit. It's green on his nose. Uh, a swimsuit, black swimsuit, yellow stuff on. Boomerang, that's supposed to be based on. Wearing um, a purplish, bluish out. Got a little daffodil emblem. Wearing a whole black mask. Dango at my baby. Tasmanian Dango, um, very, uh, outback at blue jean esque shorts, red shirt with, um, stripes on the back for purple, uh, purple ascot. And then Ghost is completely white on it, completely bluish white color, very frosty. As opposed to his original. So white all over, bit of bluish hue. Blue, 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 blue. Yeah, these are all the skins that are used for Tide Attachment. I don't know if there's any more. We'll probably have to see later on. Peter Boy. Probably just, you know, uh, how fast people figure it. Yeah, uh, the run. But I haven't done all of them, so. Yeah, I don't really care too much about leader. I'm missing a. I need to go back to the right. Find that last bolt. I don't know where it is, but uh, yeah, those are the zoom rings. This is the uh, next, the left and right uh, D pad. You can easily so I know there's a a ring. Okay, yeah. So why is our ring? But uh, as you think, yeah, this is our ring ring. Um, and you can see the images of the other rings. Once you are, a, once you get enough of the golden cogs, you can trade them into Julius. Julius will make the techno rings, and then you can select them on the ring. Um, make on the ring ring menu. Um, other than that, you can just use the uh, left and they will switch between. Um, if you go from boomerang to the, to the right, I believe, yeah, boomerang to the right, that is getting, uh, your elemental ring, because this ain't the only one, uh, fire is not the only one, trust me, because we would have been done with the game right now, um, and of course you have a ton of techno rings, that you have access. um, do I want to leave this last rank, or do, no, you know what, we'll get it and then we'll do the pet scene and then we'll call it a second. So according to this, it says the rank in shipwreck. I'm oh, sorry, not rank. The well, shipwreck. I'm missing one golden cog in shipwreck. 
By the way, I like the PS2 version, which I think might have been cut out due to time, due to the limitations. Uh, Bull's Pen, you can re-access the boss fight in this game. Also, when you complete all three of the worlds in the boss, um, bam, oh, rainbow. Get all the rainbow you scales. Found a fair dinkum rainbow scale. When you find enough, take them to the Bunyip Elder at Rainbow Cliffs. Okay. So, yeah, there are 25 in the game. And don't worry, they're all in the hub world. You'll be able to find them. They're just very well hidden. Like that one right there. Some of them, you do have to, like, get particular rings. Some of them say you do certain things. Uh, one of the big ones is precision. Yeah, shit. Down by the walk by the walk. I know. So we just gotta find this last ring. I mean this last one. Welcome. Is it the better question? Oh, by the way, the couple will be up here in the level you can um if anything. Um and I do think they skip the twenty two level, but I think if you toss it right here. Some is but I have that, and I bet you it's up. Oh boy, I hate when time changes. Um. Just when it fucks up. So I'm gonna just check this. Yeah, my miss.
That is like a brain going, but um, I don't like him. I'm saying this rain, I mean, this one has to be somewhere else. I oh, got it too in the water. Are hidden? Or maybe it's one like like plain as that. I don't know what's going to water it.
there one at base? Oh, you know what? I think there is. I probably never got it. go. It wasn't. When the crevice. Alright, now shipwreck is done. Let's go get our last, let's go our next rain. And then we will go to, I, I'm really trying not to look. Go get our next rain. some more golden cogs smashing. Ty, let's try them out in the Rang machine. Eureka! We've created a multi-rang. Multi According to my calculations, the multi-rang will allow you to throw a lot of rangs at the same time. Pew beauty! Yep. Yep, and we can see more. Uh, throw, 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 throw. That is for uh, attaining the multi rank. And this is the multi rank. It's a multi jump. Yep, you're allowed to throw multiple ranks at once. This is basically your uh, infinite rank. Alright. And with that then done, we are going to explore the next area of uh, point of interest. This cave right here. Um, yep, there's one here. That is it, because there's nothing up here. At all. Oh, so you can't even get up there. Alright, but if we go this way, um, and we use our new flame right, we can this cave. And I believe. Ah, yes, this cave is ice. Next. And if further let's see ooh black book mm, he's smaller wow. than I thought this 
Another tiger. Hmm. Ooh, the plot thicket. All right. Well, we have another nice shiny little rainbow egg here, and we have our next set of levels. So, in the next episode, we have Snow Worries, Safari Outback, and Bridge on the Roof of Time. I uh, imagine we should do quite Julius. well here because it's a perfect focal point for the talisman machine. All right, and, uh, sorry, so yeah, we got another 17 missions to accomplish, and they are all here in Area 2, the cavern. That's what I'm calling it, don't judge me. Anyway, let's wrap up today's video here, everyone. So we're gonna save our game. Alright, thirty-two percent, not bad. All right, and head and leave. And yeah, that is it. That is the end of our session for Ty the Tasmanian Tiger, ladies and I didn't record it. Oh crap! Uh, are you serious? I didn't record it. Oh uh, wow. Okay, well I have to go back into. Oh, I'll just get it from. from I just downloaded from Steam. Okay. Um, the video. I'll do some editing. I think my video player can do the editing. So, with that said and done, you guys, thanks so much for coming to the few people that came into the station. Um, that's in the chat. But if you guys really want to help the channel, you got to actually viewers of the channel. I know how this shit works. Oh, somebody subscribed. I didn't get a chance to check and see, but, um, was it? Mr. Kid 1994. Thank you for the follow. Sorry, I've been preoccupied and I didn't hear the message go off. But if you're, if you're not in the chat, uh, hopefully you're not a bot. Because if you're a bot, I want them to find out who. Okay, I don't know. I have to be very careful with these people because they can be bots and they can't just spam. Cause that's where every bots here for. Everybody don't play those games. All right. So with that said and done, thanks everybody for coming. Uh, as I do at the end of my streams, here is the video lineup for things. So if you guys want to catch my main content, here it is right here on the channel. Enter. There you go. Uh, you can visit me here on my main channel. This is where all of the content for Yu-Gi-Oh, Puzzle and Dragons, and stuff like that will be going. The next one up is the archive channel, which of course I'm going to have to work extra hard now because I got to fix uh, the archive setup for uh, Tide Has Me and Tiger. You guys can have that up there. Um, we probably might have to actually, which is rare that I actually have to do. But it's perfectly have to. Um, for social media, here is that. I have one. For social media, here is my Instagram and my um, Twitter. You guys can talk, interact with me on Twitter and Instagram. Um, also, to let you guys know, there it, there has been some updates to YouTube. So I do post now on YouTube. If you guys want to catch me? It's easy, definitely. In addition to that, of course, um, here is the Discord. So if you guys want to join in the Discord and excuse me, hang out in the Discord, you definitely can. There is a link to So with all that said and done, thanks everybody for watching. I hope you guys enjoy it. And I will catch you guys Friday. Um as Veterans Day. I have off for 